In this part of the um, scene, Ryan and Tyler are adding Tristan on MySpace and just talking about how he has glasses and about how they call him Four Eyes. And um, right here, they're adding him, adding him and making fun of him. Um, this is uh, related to the plot because just because he's different, that does not mean that he should be like made fun of. Tristan is a four. And, uh, this is I where uh, Ryan or Tyler misspells absolutely. Absolutely. You know? no and, uh, friends at It's also share. I like it, but it's not Facebook. Never mind. So, yeah. Oh, this also like shows it. how um. Okay, well. Just because they think they're more superior to Tristan, and they can make fun of him and treat him differently. Um, this is a part where Tyler is um. He's just coming upstairs to hang out, and he gets a call from Tristan, um, talking about the post on MySpace, and about how um, Tristan wants to come over and talk about it. But yeah, Tyler has to dance to the music. But about how he doesn't like how they did it, and Tyler says okay for Tristan to come over. When Tristan does show over, he's really just trying to uh, to kind of like solve the differences of like what happened, and it's just and it's trying to make friends still after everything that's happened. Tyler really can't take Tristan seriously, so he texts Ryan as you can see right now, and um, tells him to come over because Ryan was involved in the MySpace post as well. Here's Tristan at the door. Right here you can see that um, Tyler can't take Tristan seriously and is making fun of how he is wearing glasses and asks, him, asks Tristan why he has them on. And um, Tyler asks Tristan if he wants a, wants a snack. Hey, do you want a snack or anything? Um, knowing that he's just gonna pull another prank on Tristan. He can't even take him seriously, so Tyler goes and gets Oreos and comes up with another way to make fun of Tristan. This is uh, actually not real bird poop, as you can see. It's grass kind of stuff. Or it's just another part of an Oreo. Yeah. Um. Yeah. That mud pie was an actual mess up. That wasn't part of the part of the actual scene. Here's Tyler going outside to get the bird poop off the bottom of the boot in our garage. Once again, like we said, it's not actual bird poop, it's just an, part of an Oreo we scraped off. Oh, I knew there was bird poop on the bottom of that shoe. This is Tyler going back inside, putting it on top of the Oreo so he can make Tristan go through another torture mental time. Give him a little <coughs> surprise on the inside of his Oreo. Tristan, Tristan you okay in there? Back into the container. Overall, when Tristan came over, it's more of like a symbol of friendship. He's and trying, forgiveness. Because he's trying to make his, uh, he's trying to make everything, like, new and, like, good. But Tyler can't just handle that. Yeah, as you can see, Tyler can't take Tristan seriously at all. <clears throat> Even when he's puking, Tyler still has that enough and continues to make fun of him. As you can hear, you can't really see Tyler right now, but... Nothing. Even when Tristan's going home, Tyler <coughs> calls him four eyes and says what's okay. wrong and I guess I'll talk is still mean to him about it. Don't I think it's right here that eyes. Tyler says, see it four eyes. And Ryan, that's the end of scene two. Here, uh, this is Tyler and Ryan just hanging out. And uh, they they're just really bored, so they they just want to make fun of him for some reason. So Ryan calls Tristan up and says that there's a Halloween party going on actually, and they're gonna um, try to be friends with him. So 
they invite him over, and uh, Tristan decides to to wear a, a, a wolf mask, gorilla, girl gorilla mask, as uh, to the party. Yeah, hey Tristan, I'm sorry for what I did. Did you want to come over to a Halloween party tonight? It actually starts really soon. But you can come over early before everyone else. Uh, Wait, tell him to come right now. Yeah, yeah. Alright, alright, bye. Yeah, he's coming. He's coming. He's coming right now you can see that they're just oh, talking yeah. about how they're going to embarrass Tristan and what they're going to do when he gets here. Yeah, as you can see, Tyler has a camera just to embarrass Tristan and be able to remember the things they did to him. Their plan is to uh, post us to MySpace. Yeah, as you can see, Tristan is at the door and they're just planning on making fun of him and being mean. Wait, wait, don't let him see this. See, Tristan really doesn't no, friend. know what to do, so we didn't yeah. enjoy it. Yeah, you run for us. See, Ryan's still going out the door and yelling and making fun of him. Yeah, let's do it. I'm so sick and tired of that. In this next scene, it shows um, Tristan doesn't know what to do, so he, um, he's, he's at he, the breaking point. Yeah, he is at the breaking point. I'd say this is about the climax. Hello, Ryan. Starting to turn into the really, falling action. Really he, um... He's talking to Ryan and Tyler about how they really, well, he's lying to them saying a hot girl is coming over to study. And now, as you can see, they're over and they're waiting for the girl to get here. And Tristan lies and says the doorbell rings. And Ryan's sympathetic, but it doesn't bother Tristan as much as they've done to him. So, Ryan and Ryan stays downstairs while Tyler and Tristan go up to get the door. And as you can see, Tristan has a knife about to slit Tyler's throat. She's, she's, Tyler, your mom's uh, calling. About the phone rings to save Tyler's life. And walks back downstairs to get the phone. I don't know. I shown the home phone. Tyler, watch out! Ryan saves Tyler and Tristan misses. Ryan, do something. What do I do? Answered. Ryan, do something! Oh my Tristan, gosh. what's your problem? Oh Tristan, Tristan! And Tyler ah! picks up running, and there's where Ryan stabbed to death. And you can see Ryan's blood on Tristan's shirt. It must have been a gory stabbing. Oh, Tristan, why? And now Tristan's there. looking for Tyler to get his revenge. <clears throat> Tristan! On Tyler as well. Ah! And Tyler saves ah! him Tristan, by hitting his hand with a book. That, that, that was why not a real do thing. This? <laughs> Knife what? hitting down. <laughs> it was uh, <laughs> it was just like a book. Was, Tristan, yeah. Not as you can see, this is pretty much the falling action, and how Tristan is now at the breaking point and he tries to tap, snap Tyler's neck, but Tyler's just too strong for Tristan. And um, oh, in that scene, um, Tyler actually did get a bloody nose. Tyler. Just uh, tip. This is Tristan's point of view right now. Yeah, in Tristan's point of view, Tyler is trying to save Ryan. Ryan. No. It's over. Ryan, um, he's trying to wipe the blood off, Ryan. but Ryan. we yeah. were to stab and slice it, but does not yeah. kill Tristan, no. Now Tyler's wounded severely, as you can see, and he's stabbed in the in the lung. I mean, it's not a fatal wound. He's hurt severely, but he's dropped. And this is pretty much turning into the resolution, turn from the falling action to the resolution. And there is the theme of the story. And Tyler was stabbed in, in, in the no genome, so he's not like fully dead. And uh, this is where Tristan goes and kills him.